I'm Mass Dave. I've got a comment here from Gary Hammond 3117. He says, could a delta loop be horizontally installed instead of vertically? Yeah. If so, what direction would it radiate? Well, on the band where it is resonant, it'll radiate straight up or very nearly straight up. That's good for NVIS antennas. Normally, you don't see this type of antenna used horizontally. You'll get horizontal polarization out of it. Its radiation angle will be kind of weird. Now, on higher frequencies like 10 meters, the waves come down a little bit to by the time you get up to six meters, it's probably nearly horizontal. I would suggest if you're gonna put in a horizontal loop that you make it square and that you make it much longer, like for 40 meters or even 80 meters, uh, because, and the reason for this is because on its lowest frequency, it's gonna radiate pretty much straight up. It's great for NVIS, but NVIS is 80 meters and 40 meters in common usage, okay? The ionosphere affects 20 meters entirely differently. It reflects them at an angle. Usually the maximum usable frequency for straight up is in the four to seven megahertz band varies. You can get the muff from any of the stations that have an ionogram on them and you can look at it there. You can get these uh, by looking for them on Google, okay? So I would recommend that be vertical and it will radiate vertically. Note that you can get horizontal radiation out of a vertical loop by feeding it in a different place. And you, I'll let you look in the handbook for which place gives you horizontal, which place gives you vertical. Okay, till we next meet, 73.